Hi there, it's Mark Sebastian, founder of Option Pit, and this is the Stock Market and Option Volatility Report. Reminder, this is for education purpose only. shouldn't be considered investment advice. Options carry risk. Hey, I, I want to show you something. So on the front cover is our, our trading volatility offer. It's basically everything we have in volatility. Everything for $9.97. We're talking like a $3,000 value. And you can also watch my research. See, look, Jim Cramer and technician Mark Sebastian. I don't know why they call me a technician, but I did a whole thing on what's what uh, what's happened with volatility. Uh, and you can uh, you can come and check that out. It's uh, really fascinating what's uh, what's been going on with VIX, and you can kind of see my analysis. So, speaking of analysis, how about this market? Um, we're up, but we've got some a little funky action today. Uh, I want to point out, even though we're up and the market is, you know, right at, so this is an important level, 26.20. Why is that an important level? Well, I'll show you. Take a look at this, at the where the S&P is in relative terms. We are within a stone's throw of the 50-day moving average. We're right there. Um, and the two are are meeting each other. So... The question is, you know, what's next? All right. We just had VIX expiration day. VIX expiration. And you can see that it's caused the VIX to rally. You know, now that it's over. So a little pop, uh, you know, has me wondering, you know, are we going to see, you know, one or two day pullback? Yeah, the indexes look really nice. The recordings look real nice, but, um, you know, I don't know so, the recordings. The VIX, you know, the, the indexes look real nice, but the VIX is saying, hey, maybe uh, maybe there's a little fear, right? As we sit here, you know, vol futures are still down a little bit, a little bit, but not very much. Down a nickel. VIX is up 20 cents. We've seen things kind of catch up to each other. All right. Earnings this morning. You know, Bank of America, another good bank stock. You know, that's that's why we're up is the bank stocks. And, you know, you can also see that some of the other names like, you know, Apple having a nice little recovery. But that said, if the S&P is right near that, uh, that 50-day moving average, the cues are now over it. So there's another reason to think, hey, maybe maybe, uh, maybe we're at a little bit of a, a worry spot where we have a little retest here. So uh, as, as good as the last few days are, I would not be surprised if we don't see a little bit of a pullback into expiration this weekend and a little bit of a lift in volatility. Um, I think you're starting to see some hedging activity take place. And... I am not a uh, a big believer in the market today. Vol, uh, you know, there's there's hedging activity today, so I, I think you're going to see today could go a little bit red, uh, and we could see vol back off a little bit. Um, you know, back toward you know maybe 19. All right, folks. I hope everybody has a great day, a great morning. Good afternoon. I will talk to you soon.